All right, coming up next, a matchup for the UFC flyweight division title. Well, it's got to feel good for this man to make this walk. He has chewed up and spit out all comers on his run to contention. Now he is the undisputed number one contender looking to become the new UFC flyweight champion. A lot of people think he has the skills to do just that. Tonight, though, his opportunity to prove it in front of a sold-out crowd tonight that he is the best 125-pound fighter on the planet. So here we go with this UFC Flyweight Championship fight, and there is the man out of the red corner, the reigning defending, undisputed UFC Flyweight Champion, making his way to the octagon. He's defended this belt before. This is not new territory for this young man who believes that the rest are just the rest. He believes he is the best at 125 pounds and looking to prove just that here tonight. Tail of the tape for this flyweight championship fight. Four years apart, and they have the same height and reach. We go inside the octagon. Here's the veteran voice, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds for the UFC Flyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet, two inches tall. Weighing in at 116 pounds, fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, presenting the challenger, Voodoo. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet, two inches tall, weighing in at 116 pounds, fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA, presenting the reigning defending undisputed UFC flyweight champion of the world downtown all right this is for UFC championship I want you to obey my commands at all times protect yourself at all times I want a nice clean safe fight touch gloves so back to your corners come out front. So two truly elite strikers here. We sat down with them on Thursday and asked them, any thoughts of taking this fight to the ground? They want to strike. They want to strike. That's what goes. Oh. Oh, that He's out. He's done. He's done. <laughs> yes, sir. It goes into the books as a first round win by knockout. Near perfect execution. The technique was absolutely gorgeous. And again, when you catch a guy early, maybe you're getting him cold before he's had a chance to look like a sweat or even get into the fight a little bit. Those strikes can have a bigger effect, and it certainly did here tonight. And there is the UFC flyweight champion. What a knockout he turned in here tonight. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 19 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC flyweight champion of the world, Dan And still UFC 
flyweight champion. He is the best 125-pounder in the world, and tonight there seemed to be a pretty wide margin between number one and number two. Yeah, but number one, I mean, he is turning these challengers away like flies. He's a great fighter, man. He's hard to deal with. He does everything top-notch.